This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakwa Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakwa Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakwa is the senior pastor of the Morning Star Cathedral, Lighthouse Chapel International, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Hello. Kakwa has been sharing on a subject he calls how to profit from free labor. Previously, he explained some benefits of free labor. Today, he talks about yet another benefit. Let's join in. As I said, on an interesting topic I titled, How to Profit from Free Labor. How to Profit from Free Labor. Proverbs 14, verse 23, it says, In all labor, there is profit, but the talk of the lips tends only to penury. Penury means poverty. And it says that it's always better to work even if you are unemployed than to just be sitting down talking. So the question is, if there is profit in free labor, how do you get this profit? Amen. Amen. Now the word profit, it means to get an advantage. Which means, if you have an advantage even without money, it's profit. The word profit means to get a benefit. Which means, if you get a benefit out of something without even being paid, then you have made profit. For example, in Luke chapter 5, Jesus said in verse 4, he said, launch out into the deep and let down your net for a draft. Then Peter said, master, we have toiled all night and have taken nothing. Nevertheless, at thy word, I will let down the net. Verse 6 says, when they had this done, they enclosed a great multitude of fishes and their net broke. Peter made profit, but the profit that he made was not financial. But eventually, what he gained from Jesus yielded financially, but indirectly. But his immediate profit had nothing to do with money. So number one, if you want to profit from free labor, the first thing is that you must change your mindset by redefining what profit is. Wow. This message will continue after this short message. How to deal with fear. Fear is an emotion. But the Bible says that that emotion called fear can affect your mind. And your decisions. Paul said, For when we were come to Macedonia, our flesh had no rest. We were troubled on every side. Without the fightings, within were fears. So even the great Paul, he had his own fears based on what was going on around him. Order this message series through the following means. Call us on WhatsApp or send a WhatsApp message to plus 233 55 700 9010. You can also send an email to info at or make a regular call or send a text to plus 233 20 7575215. Welcome back. Number two. To profit from free labor, you must be able to identify the profit. The word identify, it means to know what something is. Let's look at some few things we have to identify. Number one, favor is profit. Favor is profit. One of the highest things that you can ever have is favor. In case you didn't know. When Jesus came into the world, Before the anointing, there were two things that he was looking for. Wisdom and favor. Luke 2.40, the child grew, was strong in spirit, filled with wisdom. The grace of God was upon him. Luke 2.52, Jesus increased in wisdom and stature and in favor before God and man. The Bible didn't say he grew in dollars. He said he grew in favor. Why? 
You know, favor is more than money. You can increase the level of favor on your life before men or you can decrease it. The Bible says he increased in favor before men. So what it means is that you can intentionally increase the level of favor on your life if you know what to do. Look at your neighbor and say, favor is an invisible currency that can be traded. Push your neighbor and say, favor is the highest currency in the world. If you have it, you will buy things without using money. And it will be as good as spending money. Thanks for joining us. Today we learned that one of the profits we must identify from free labor is favor. Join us same time tomorrow as Kakra continues this message. Before we leave, here is a praise report to boost your faith in the Lord. Five weeks pregnant. Dear Kakra, I contacted you in April to help me in prayers concerning the fruit of the womb, and you prayed for me. I write to testify that I'm now five weeks pregnant. Glory be to God. Thanks for your time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full length message, or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to 233 55 70 Send an email to info at .org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony, and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you.